Hello, hello guys, it's Fira and welcome to new video. Today's video is a little different than my usual video because this is a makeup video. Actually, I've been wanting to do more makeup video since I love makeup and I have been learning makeup a lot. I want to be better at makeup since makeup and fashion, they go hand in hand. They go together, they are one package. It is actually really fun to film a makeup video. So do you guys want to see more makeup videos from me? Because I honestly really really enjoy this. Anyway, um, this is the look for today. I really really love it. This eye makeup, it is, I feel like this is so my style. This is my color. I had low expectation for me when I just started filming this because I am not confident in my eyeshadow skills but this actually turned out um, better than I expected so if you guys want to know how I create this look then let's go and watch okay here we go I'm going to explain to you the situation here so my cousin Jihan and I we have been wanting to play makeup together. We love playing makeup together and we actually filmed a video where she did my makeup. Um, if you haven't watched that, then make sure to watch that because it's quite a fun video. I will put the link to the video in the description box down below. Anyway, um, we have been wanting to play makeup together but we haven't seen each other for months now she lives in Medan and I live here in Bogor. So, um, I think it was Jihan's idea. Jihan has this idea. Another alternative for us to be able to play makeup together is by designing each other's look. So, I created the look that I want Jihan to, to do. So, she will do her own makeup but with the look that I created. And I'm going to do the look that Jihan has created for me. I think I will put the um, the picture of the eyeshadow look that Jihan has created here and I'm going to attempt to create that look. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna start by putting a primer on my face. Okay, so I'm gonna start by putting a primer on my face first. The primer that I will be using today is this one by Maybelline. I think I'm going to not talk so loudly since um, there is someone outside. <music> I should have tied it. Oh, I actually have a hair tie here on my wrist. Should I tie it? <laughs> you know what, I think I can handle it. So after primer, the next thing that I'm going to put on my face is foundation. Literally every face product that I'm going to be using here is by Maybelline. I just love Maybelline's face products. The foundation that I'm going to be using today is Maybelline Fit Me. I love this foundation. concealer and this is also a Maybelline Fit Me. I'm going to draw three dots under my eyes here as well for here because they are pretty red there so I want to cover that. I'm going to also cover um, some red spots on my face. I like to just 
use my hand to cover the red spots. I feel like it works better with my hand rather than with a beauty blender. So the next step is powder. I also use a Maybelline Fit Me powder and this is new. I have never tried this before. From what I've heard, Maybelline Fit Me powder is really good. So that's why I wanted to try this out. I'm going to get my beauty blender again. But I don't know how to use this though. What? Oh. Oh. There's a tape here. Oh. Okay, okay. Let's let's open the tape first. Um I was confused as to why nothing came out. The tape is pretty strong. Why is it so strong? <gasps> oh, oh god. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to apply is bronzer and I'm going to be using this one by Floma, Fl Floma, Flormar, Floma. Now I am going to do my blush. This is Amina Chiclet Pressed Blush and the shade is Cotton Candy. It looks like this, just a very bright pink blush. I really love this kind of color for blush. I'm also going to apply a little blush on my nose as well to create a sun-kissed look. After blush, I am going to do my eyebrows and the product that I'm going to be using for my eyebrows is... This is a L'Oreal Paris Brow Artist Expert. Okay, so I'm going to brush my eyebrows upwards. And now I'm going to fill them in accordingly to my natural shape. are done and now we're going to move on to the main event of this video which is the eyeshadow look from the look of it I feel like I might understand how to do this but what I imagine in my head is usually different than what I ended up doing it's the expectation versus reality um, but let's see so this is the look that you had created very very beautiful before we get to it, I want to show you this eyeshadow palette. This is going to be the eyeshadow palette that I'm going to be using for this video. This is by Beauty Glazed. Just wait until you see how this eyeshadow palette works. So you open this and it shows a beautiful green palette. Then open it. And it shows this beautiful red, orange, brown colors. And you open it again. And there is another palette. And it's not over. You open this blue palette again. And ta-da! And this is going to be the palette that I'm going to be using today. Oh my god. Oh my god, I actually don't mind, but for some people who do mind, I'm sorry, I didn't realize it. 
Okay, anyway, alright. Okay, I don't really know which one I should apply first. I think I should start with the lightest color. So I'm going to take this color. I'm just going to apply it from my inner eyelid until the middle part. Jihan, if you're watching, am I doing this right? I don't know. Now I'm going to take this color. So I'm going to apply it from the middle part until the outer part. I'm going to build this up to make it look darker. And then I'm going to drag this here. To apply it with a smaller brush right here on the outer side okay this is going quite well it's not really as dark as I thought it would look like but um, I am actually kind of satisfied with it. I don't know if I should make it darker or not, but I actually already like this um, color. Now I am going to pick this shimmery color because from the picture, the middle part seems to be shimmery and I'm going to apply it only on the middle part of my eyelid. So right here. <laughs> Should I just apply it with my hand? Usually shimmery eyeshadows or sparkly eyeshadows, they apply better with your finger. Okay, let's just use the brush for now. But if I want to build it up, I think I'm going to use my finger. Oh, it's actually really pretty. That's actually really beautiful, but I kind of want to know how it would look like if I use my finger. So I'm just gonna get a little bit here on my finger and just try to apply it with my finger a little. Oh, that is definitely a lot more intense than with a brush. I think that is enough shimmer. I kind of really want the inner part to be really shiny so um, even though the picture doesn't really have this color I'm just going to add it on my own because I feel like a little shine here will make it look really pretty so I'm going to get this color and I am using my hand for this because I really want it to pop and I'm going to apply it here Oh my god, okay, that is really intense. I did not expect it to be that intense. I don't think I should have applied with my finger. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> I'm just going to kind of blend it a bit with my brush. That is actually pretty, but I feel like it's a, a bit too big that I wanted it to look like. I haven't done anything for this part of my eyes, so I'm going to work on that now. I think I'm going to use this color. <laughs> Okay, I like it. I'm going to darken this part a little bit. Now I'm going to move on with eyeliner. The eyeliner that I'm going to be using today is also by Maybelline. This is the eyeliner that I will be using. It's Hyper Sharp Power Black. died so while waiting for the battery to charge I finished the other eyes makeup so now we're going to continue doing this again I finished the eyeliner I just did 
a simple eyeliner now I'm going to continue um, lining my tight line using this um, the Body Shop Velvet Gel Pen Eyeliner and now I am going to curl my eyelashes I usually like to do it twice so this is the first one and the second one I will do it like this okay that is perfect my eyelashes are a little non-existent they are quite thin and also quite short and they are also very straight and I'm going to use this again a Maybelline product this is Maybelline Total Temptation waterproof mascara I usually don't really apply mascara on my bottom lashes because well they're they're even more non-existent <laughs> Then my upper lashes but for today I am going to put just a little bit just because I feel like that is a good combination with the eyeshadow it is still going to look non-existent but if you just look really really closely you can see that it's there the eyes are done it's almost done um, I think I am going to apply the blush again thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to put on highlighter and the highlighter that I will be using today is not focused this one by the body shop and I'm going to apply it with my finger since it applies better like I get this one and then this one and then I will just boop it on my nose <music> Apply it here on the bridge of my nose. Take it again and apply it here on my cupid's bow. And now we have come to the last step for the makeup and it is lipstick. I am still deciding the colors. Um, this is softer but I feel like this one no, I don't think it matches. Okay, let's just go with this Shu Uemura one. If you want to see more of me and you haven't subscribed to me, then please subscribe. If you like this video, then like it. And I shall see you guys on my next video. Bye-bye!